This is the Sunday Business Page with John Delano. Good morning, I'm John Delano. Welcome to another home edition of the Sunday Business Page. And our special guest today is Michael Ogden, who is the CEO of the Recovery Centers of America in Monroeville. Michael, thank you, sir, very much for being with me. I appreciate that. Good morning, John. It's a pleasure to be here. So RCA, Recovery Centers of America, what exactly is that? So Recovery Centers of America is a uh, drug and alcohol uh, treatment company. Um, we're uh, headed out of King of Prussia, Pennsylvania, and we're here to uh, save lives and to be able to offer quality care for people uh, who suffer from uh, mental health and addiction issues. And you are heading up the first RCA facility in the Pittsburgh area and coming home. Is that right? That's correct. I was uh, born and raised in Pittsburgh. Um, love this town. It's, 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 it's in our blood. Um, you know, I left the city, but the city never left me. And it's a pleasure to be back home. Well, we're, we're glad to have you back home. And I guess what I'd like to ask you uh, is a little bit more about what RCA does. Uh, you handle and really treat folks both inpatient and outpatient who have addiction issues. Is that fair to say? That's fair to say. That's exactly what we do. And we do it in an environment that's uh, nurturing and it's open and it's really designed to help people to understand that there's a different way of living their life and they don't have to suffer from addiction. Um, so we're, we're hiring people here and making sure that we have a, a world-class facility for them to be able to come in and get their uh, business done and go back out in the world with their families and, and be whole again. You are actually looking to hire some 100 plus people for this uh, facility in Monroeville? That's correct. So we're looking at anywhere from 100 to 150 employees to be able to help us join as team members to fight addiction. What kind of employees are you looking for? What kind of skills do you need? And, and by the way, this facility is gonna open up in January, is that right? That is correct, January 21. And we're looking for all kinds of people. Um, we have entry level positions, of course, to, to uh, work with the day to day things that we have to do. And we're also hiring nurses, we're hiring uh, doctors, we're hiring professionals and therapists uh, to work in this environment. And I should ask you this question because I think a lot of people are really under a lot of stress particularly at the holiday season because of COVID. Has COVID increased the number of people with addictions who need help from facilities like yours? Absolutely. The, the toll that COVID has taken on people in recovery has been tremendous. You know, one of the things that we talk about is uh, frequently in, in our business is that we frequently talk about the need for people to connect with other people and to be able to uh, share their feelings and their emotions and go to AA meetings and do those kind of things because we know that that's what works for people. But unfortunately with COVID that can't happen. So the feeling of isolation really uh, sets in with it. And we recognize that COVID is a, is a threat to all of us, right? So we've set up special ways to bring people in, to, to have them come into our treatment programs and safe and we test all of our people to make sure that uh, people are COVID free. We wear our masks, we hand wash, we do everything that's necessary to protect ourselves and to have, give people the opportunity to be able to address their addiction. And again, your facility will be opened up in, uh, I guess in January. Will people be able to just walk in and ask for help? So we have a, a number of ways that can do that. We do have walk-ins that are available for people, but we prefer people to call 1-800-RECOVERY. Um, so we have that number, it's easy, it's convenient, it's very simple to remember. Um, they can call into the call center and we have professionals there waiting for them 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Well, Michael Ogden, the new CEO of Recovery Centers of America, Monroeville, thank you so much, sir, for being with us today. I really appreciate it. Thank you, John, it's been a pleasure to be here and so excited to offer something to the city that gave me so much, so thank I you. Thank you, and thank you for watching us on the Sunday Business Page. If you have a suggestion for a guest, get in touch with me at jdelano at kdka.com. Have a great Sunday, everyone, and happy Thanksgiving.